Remember what's the name of this place? Klamath Falls. Klamath Falls KOA. And this is us leaving. This is the 27th? 27th. 27th of July. Wait, let me check the date. Linda's checking the date. What a really nice campground. Really, yes. really nice. We enjoyed this place. Yes, we sure did. And then Rick and Diane have gone on. They left earlier this morning. They're heading out to, uh, I guess first their plan is Wendover, Nevada, and then on from there. And we're heading down into California to see Jim and Yosemite. Right. pretty neat because you see up ahead of us they got gas tanks on the way in or on the way out and the gas is very reasonable considering what it is around the rest of the town so we're going to stop right up here and have them this is Oregon they have to pump it for you there's no self-serving Oregon so we will stop up here and have them come out and pump us some gas Olean. here we go <laughs> here to see what we're here heading down here to see the sundial bridge all right it's the only sundial bridge i think in the world no way i think so well who else would have thought of it and it's an actual working sundial no way mm -hmm. you're serious i'm so oh, serious all right, let's go look at it luckily the sun is shining in uh redding today <laughs> yeah and the projected temperature today in Redding, California is? 113 degrees. 113 degrees. We were told yesterday that it is a, going to be nine days now of at least 110 degrees. Mm -hmm. So including today, 10 days in a row of temperatures over 110 degrees. Luckily we're sun worshippers, right? I suppose we are. <laughs> okay, Linda, first look, here it comes. Oh my goodness. Awesome. <laughs> so let, let's read All right, Linda, tell me all about this place. Okay, so it was finished in um, 2003, uh -huh. and the architect described it as a, a goose. Um, that he, he thought it seemed like a goose, but it's super cool. It's made out of glass and metal, and um, it is... It cost $24 million to construct over the Sacramento River. Oh, I see here that it has glass panels on the deck 
but they reach 150 degrees Fahrenheit in the summer, which yeah. is today. Yeah. Today, it will be 150 degrees on that deck. Right. It says you wear good shoes and all because it's very hot. Right. So here, but here we go. This is it. <clears throat> We should be able to, well, they're kind of... They're frosty. Not exactly clear oh, anymore. Oh, you can see through them. Yeah. Oh, wow. So we'll get out over the bridge and see what we see. This is it. Super cool. Yeah. So, what did you say? This is the Sacramento River? Yeah, Sacramento River. Yeah. Sacramento River. Mm -hmm. Look at the size of these cables here. That is huge. <laughs> it's, so, it's gigantic. Yeah, I mean, when you're standing under it like this and looking up, it's I'm like, are you kidding me? Here, All right, so here's what's really cool. This, uh, this sundial, there's a sun up there. This sundial of a bridge, you can see the shadow coming right down through here. Now, I just looked at my watch. It is 11.10. And so this right here says that when the shade is here, it's 11 o'clock at the summer solstice, which is the 21st of June. Here's the shade, which puts it right at exactly the time my watch says it is. And then as you walk along this path here, right there it says 11.15. We're coming on down here 11.30. Right there's 11.30. Here's 11.45, and then back to the hour, and this would be 12 noon. My shadow. <laughs> but as you can see, that thing is setting the doggone shade right on the hours, just as the little radius here says it should. So, very accurate clock. relaxing in Redding, California at the JGW RV uh, park. That's right. Uh, it has been very hot here, but we've survived very well. Today it's going to be about 11 degrees cooler than the last few days, but still up to 103, which is unbelievable. But it, uh, what it, a nice park. It's right? a very nice park, and it's um, a beautiful town. Reading we really like. We're going to go somewhere I've never been and I've been dying to go. In yeah. and Out Burger. In and Out Burger. It's, it's just a, a silly thing. Most of you, a lot of you probably have already been, but I've never been, so I'm dying to go. In and Out Burger. We're going to mail a gift to Aunt Paula. So her birthday is next week. 
and um, we're going to be up for birthday presents. That's right. That's right. And maybe do some other fun stuff. We'll, we'll see. Yeah. But we just wanted to check in. We're just taking a few days to sort of relax a little bit. We had quite a trip coming back from Alaska. Through Canada. Through Canada. So we're taking uh, a few days to just relax and uh, enjoy well, life. Well, we have uh, we have set reservations yeah. at uh, uh, Yosemite. You have mm -hmm. to have reservations to get into the park. Right. And because we did make such good time coming through Canada, yeah. we do have these extra days here. So we are relaxing and enjoying our time here. From here, we're going to uh, Petaluma on the coast where the high is 68. We'll 68. be there for three days, 67, 68, 67, so uh -huh. that's the high. And then we're going to Modesto to sweet, see our sweet nephew Jim and Hillary, sweet Hillary, and then we're going to Yosemite, so we've got lots to show you. Lots to show you coming up, and then across the United States. That's right, so we'll see you soon. You got it. Okay, so Linda, we're at the... Wind River Casino. In yeah, Redding. in Reading. Look at that beautiful bowl, isn't which that, is actually a fountain. Isn't that so pretty? And here is the entrance to the casino. Obviously, you know, we're going to act as though funds are getting a little low <laughs> and we need to kick it up. So we're taking Linda in there to, you know, make it rain, right? Oh, yeah. Make it rain. You going to win a little something for us? Why not? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They'll probably shut her down after a little while because they just can't have one person taking all the money, right? Plus, well, no one can figure out my uh, system. That's right. It's a system. <laughs> all right. Here we go. We are at in Burger in Redding. And Redding, California. And everything is so cute. There because are little red palm trees everywhere. On the cups, on the wallpaper, on the trim, everywhere. And Terry ordered a number one, which is a double double French fries and medium mm -hmm. drink. And I ordered a number three, which is a hamburger, French fries, and medium drink. And we'll show it to you when we get it. That's right. All right, Linda. Yes. I'm about to pan down. Okay, so here we go. Here's the unveiling. All right. French fries. These look good. So this is Terry's double double. Double double. I'll turn it around. And that's my regular hamburger. Oh, and this is the delicious oh, looking french fries. Gosh. Our very first in and out burger oh, ever. With soda waters. Look oh. at the double, 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 double. Double, double. Oh, yeah. Here we go, you guys. We wanted to give you a review of the in and out burger. And we give it two thumbs up. Two opposable thumbs up? Two opposable thumbs up. The food is delicious, fresh, and there is gracious plenty. So I got a single burger. It has tomatoes and lettuce on it. All these fries and a drink for $7.15. It is delicious. Absolutely delicious. Plenty of food. I, we absolutely recommend it. First time it had an out burger. Amen. All right, Linda, tell me where we're at. This is our campground, uh, the JGW campground in Reading, and this is the Sacramento River. That is the Sacramento River. We're a couple hundred miles away from Sacramento, but um, this is the river. And looking back up here, you see the backside of the campground. We've been here a few days and it was very, very hot when we first got here. And now it's uh, high today's only going to be like 101 or two. Yeah, it's much cooler. All right, the Sacramento River behind our campsite. I need to get a different camera, see what that is over there. <laughs> It's so funny. Yeah, I love it. Insane cold. But the lake's great. Uh-huh. So. <laughs> That's funny. Well, if you're really hot, just run out there, I guess. I know. <laughs> I know. Yeah, no, we did it last night. <laughs>
You guys have a really good trip. Thanks. You too. We're leaving today. We've been here for a few days. Where are you well, heading? Be safe. We live in Oregon. Oh, okay. So, heading that way. All right, Linda, we're walking up now yeah. onto uh, our motorhome. This is really a nice place. I mean, if you look at these sites, they have some trees on them. Yeah. They have grass, you know, gravel in areas that don't need grass. And, and then the asphalt. The problem is, if there's a problem, is that when it's 114 degrees outside, this asphalt is hot. Right. But we're, we're walking up on our side up here. And uh, they're pull through, mm -hmm. but there are two pull throughs, which is interesting. Yeah. Hasn't been a problem so far. But, but I mean, if they put somebody behind us, we couldn't very well hook our car up unless we pulled out like this was a back end. Right. So, but that, like I say, hasn't been a problem because nobody's been back there. <sighs> and there, um, there's, here's a little walkway between. Um, yeah. Sites. So here we are. And this you is our site. Yeah, there's a good space between each one. Right, each and one then has a picnic table. with the tree right there, uh, and this shrub thing, by the time that our canopy is not making shade in the evening for us, all the vegetation is. All right, so we're at the pool area. Yes. And uh, we just checked out the laundry. So we'll be heading on back and maybe getting our swimsuits on and yes. coming back with a load of laundry. That sound fair? That sounds like a fabulous idea. All right. Hi, right, Linda, where are you at now? Now we're in the pool and it feels absolutely fine. <laughs> <laughs> This is the pool we're we're actually doing just a little bit of uh what you call laundry. A little bit of laundry while we swim. Yeah, and the laundry room is right there. You can see the kayak on the car. So we're right up here enjoying ourselves and beautiful. And we're so lucky because it's a Sunday and this campground is pretty I mean there's a lot of people here and there's nobody else here. That's right. So it feels amazing. Here we I go. I think it's about it's not quite 100 degrees right now. Yeah, right, so right at 100, good. which is not 114 it has been. Right, so it feels good and uh, it feels amazing. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to do a backwards fall into the pool. Okay. Are you ready for a backwards fall into the pool? Okay, I'm ready. Let's see if we can do this without dying. Be careful. All right, really? I'm not going to hit nothing, right? Okay. 